What's happening, family? Hello, you too. Welcome back to The Cookout. We are out here because we are ready to do some turkey burger sliders on the Blackstone. On this the will Blackstone. be an excellent appetizer for Super Bowl, but too bad when you see the Super Bowl be over with. <laughs> Patrick Mahomes will already have the uh, Super Bowl 58 uh, trophy in his hand. Or the 49ers. No. We're going for Pat, though. We going are going to <laughs> go for the Chiefs, so. But ingredients, because this is going to be Chef Extra with the orange apron off to match his Blackstone. I told y'all he extra. <laughs> but so we have, you can use this with regular ground beef, but we're using turkey, um, ground turkey. Yeah, we're going to have 85%. Mm -hmm. We're going to have pickles. we got the Hawaiian rolls, which technically on our keto diet, we're not supposed to have. So shh, don't tell nobody. Don't, 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 don't tell nobody. Look. 15 carbs. Okay, still for one. I'm one probably eat three because they're small. So you have your pickles, your King's Hawaiian um, rolls, you have Dukes. If y'all use anything but Dukes, shame on you. Shame on y'all. You have your uh, tomatoes and you have your lettuce. And this is just part of the seasoning because we got our secret, secret sauce. sauce. Secret, secret seasoning sauce. sauce. So I'll let you get started and tell them what you do. All right. Well, with the Smash burgers, y'all know I had put the beef on the Blackstone and then kind of put the season on top. So with the turkey, I'm gonna reverse that. I'm gonna take my secret sauce I have here. As the wife said, y'all seen some of the ingredients we use. And that's not all of the ingredients we use. It's just, this is just the main feature. Main. But there's some other things that we do use in there. But you just use the seasoning of your choice. However you like your burgers to taste, you add that seasoning. And I, and I just like my stuff just seasoned. You know, I don't want nothing bland or plain. Or, I want no bland meat at the mountain. No, nah, not at no the bland. mountain. Come to the cookout and be like, I ain't going back to the cookout because that meat was dry and didn't have no seasoning. And this is what, three pounds? Three pounds of three turkey? Three pounds okay. of turkey. Okay. Man down, man down. So I'll go ahead and do this right quick because we need to get these on that Blackstone fam. Y'all will be over soon. And it's not really, it doesn't take long to cook this. Nah, this is a quick cook. And what I find too is like, if you have small children um, or you have red children like we do, with getting the King's Hawaiian rolls, they cut so small and not just this brand, you can get the regular brand, you get the food line brand, doesn't matter. But they're they're easy to have in their hands and they eat them up, it's, it's, it's just easy all the way around. It's a quick cook, quick delicious cook. And I didn't put the cheese out, but we're gonna put cheese on here as well oh, yeah. because they're gonna be cheese turkey sliders. Another thing to note that we're not doing, but you can do, some people like to have onions on their burgers. So you can like chop up some onions and cook them if you want them all cooked on there and then cook that on there and so you don't have to add them after the fact. But if you like the raw onions, you can do that as well. All right, so after doing my mix here, I'm gonna, y'all know how I do, I'm gonna change my gloves out. Put that in the trash. You need two or one? Uh, let me get two. Let me get two. I didn't have my orange, y'all. Y'all know I like my orange gloves. Extra, <laughs> extra. Let me see here. Now, I don't know if any of you all watched our Bartesian because we have several other items that we display on our channel, but we did a drawing for the Bartesian and we know that we have um, subscribers who are here specifically for Blackstone. So we wanna let you know we have not forgotten you. Uh, we'll do another cook probably next week and we will actually tell you what the drawing is gonna be because we're well over 3,000, uh, not 3,000 sub subscribers, but 3,000 views and well over 600 subscribers. So we wanna kinda like give you something to say thank you for watching us. So what I'm gonna do now is take these Hawaiian rolls and cut them in half and that way I can put a little bit of, of this Duke mayonnaise on there when I'm- Only Duke. Only Dukes. <laughs> Some of y'all like that miracle with, that ain't no mayonnaise. No, no, ain't no mayonnaise. It ain't no mayonnaise. But, uh, but I've already pre-cut this kind of to save some time. Knife, just kind of get it, cut it however you see fit. I need me an electric knife, fam. Give me an electric mm. knife. That'd be nice with me. So I'm gonna get some of this uh, Dukes here. So as he stated, he had already taken the Hawaiian rolls out and sliced them in half, and now he's just spreading the Duke's mayonnaise, mayonnaise. on there. You better not say Miracle Wheel. I know, because <laughs> what we do is, and you'll see the process when we go out on the Blackstone, but he's actually going to give these a little heat 
um, and you're gonna cook in the mayo on the actual uh, Hawaiian. Trying to get that little crisp. And we're about out of dukes, y'all. He's scraping the barrel on this one. Ah, dang. <laughs> Yeah, something that fell on the other one. Yeah, I'll wipe that off. Rub that in, that's enough right there. I don't want it too soggy. All right. All right, fam, now it's time for me to go out there and get this, put this meat, this turkey meat on the on the griddle. And I'll wait a little while before I do my bread, make sure my turkey, now it don't, turkey cook quick. It's, it's a whole lot quicker than that beef. But like I said, this is 85% here. Don't want it too dry, but, uh. Y'all stay tuned. Meet you at the Blackstone. So I don't know if you all understand what he did. Because we're going to add this uh, turkey burgers or turkey ground beef to the buns, we wanted to make sure that he cooks it and it's the same size. So he measured off the size of the turkey so that when he puts it on the Blackstone, he doesn't have to manipul manipu manipulate, it. <laughs> manipulate it as much so that it fits on the slider so that it's a perfect fit. As we go out on the grill, you'll understand what we're talking about. Right. Stay tuned. Out with the black stone. So I'm going to spray a little bit of Pam. I'm going to make sure I don't block the camera view where y'all can see me. I'm going to start about middle ways. Y'all see that griddle all nice and black and seasoned? That's the way we like it at the mountain. So this is the aluminum foil I was telling y'all. Got a little bit of Pam on it up under the bottom so it don't stick. So hopefully I spread it up on that. I'm gonna go this route. Oh yeah. I want the steak. I'm gonna just mash it just a little bit, not too much. Now we just wait. Let it cook. We'll be back. All right, fam, we're back. I'm gonna go ahead and flip this meat. I'm gonna spray a little bit of Pam on my spatula to make sure this turkey does not stick to my spatula. I'm gonna try to do this successfully. Let's see what we got. Got it nice and brown. Sometimes we flip it, no issues. But the thing to note is this is turkey meat. So turkey meat, the consistency is not as good as your regular ground beef, which is usually we do like an 80-20, I think it is, or 83, something like that. Yeah. But turkey is very lean. Very so, lean. But hey, it's going to be delicious either way. Stay tuned for the final product. All right, fam, let's see what we have. We're going to check this temperature. See where we have this meat. So we had one, we actually had one, 68, okay. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and put my cheese on here and go ahead and get that uh, on the top and go ahead and put my bun on there. This cook is about finished. Y'all see how we do that? Just lay that cheese on top, let it melt. Damn, I done got hungry too. And I'm just gonna split one and put it on them ends. Uh, let's see here. Kinda fold it, y'all know how we do cheese. Well, honey, will you reach me my rolls, please? Yes, 
sir. Thank you, thank you. Remember, we already have these rubbed down. Just gonna put them on here and get a little Get a little crisp on that bun. So let's pull the grill down and we'll be finished here shortly, fam. Talk to you soon. Let's see where, where we at with those buns. Let's take a little peek. They do not take long. They're already browning up. Oh yeah. That's why you think we need to get a little browner? Just a little bit, that's I good for that's you. that's good, yep. Okay. I'm gonna take this meat here. Matter of fact, let me, uh, you know, my meat is actually bigger than my spatula, so I'm gonna cut me a little piece off right here. And I'm gonna lay it up here so y'all can see it. Y'all see that? Yes. Just gonna put this right on top of it. And of course, we'll take it in and kind of cut it, dice it up, put your trimmings on it. And this is what we're looking at. Y'all look at that. Doesn't that look delicious? Like he said, we're gonna take that inside and dress it up. We will show you how we dress our sliders in just a second. Fam, we back inside. We had the Blackstone Grill grilling. We got these turkey sliders inside. Now we're gonna cut them up. We are going to dress it to our liking. Well, you know, you know we're gonna take a bite and let you see all of this deliciousness. <laughs> I like, I'm not really big on um, onions unless they're cooked, but tomato, lettuce, and um, pickles, a little ketchup and a little mustard goes a long way. So you got one already cut up? He cutting the whole thing instead of just well, cutting us up one yeah, you know, so we can go ahead and do the taste test right now. Let y'all go ahead on about your life. You did sound with extra though, right? Extra you long. Do it, do it one time. One so let time. me get one and go ahead and do this so we can end this video. So I'm going to add a little more stirred to mine. I have to have a piece that the uh, turkey kind of split up a little bit, but that's okay. And then, up, oh, ketchup got a little far off of me. I like to add about two pickles on there. And fam, she meant to say she's gonna fix two. No, I'm gonna fix one, because <laughs> he's still cutting. And then I'm gonna put some little bit of lettuce on there. And voila, look at there. Can't see it all that good. Then I'm gonna pick this bad boy up like this here. Ooh, it's falling apart, y'all. But you take it like this. Mmm. Y'all, y'all know that's not even right. <laughs> you gonna, you gonna eat in my face? I'm cutting up all of it. Like, I got a fix for that. Mm-hmm. I don't choose. Look, mm -hmm. this is delicious, y'all. So y'all, we thank you so much for watching. We hope this channel empowers, inspires, entertains, and keeps you informed. Be blessed, family. See you later, family.